Good evening, everybody. This is EB, the YouTube Poop Master, here yet again. And today, I am continuing my Papa Louie um, review series. Now, last time, I reviewed Papa's Pizzeria. Now, today, I'll be reviewing Papa's Burgeria. Now, today, this is going to be a really slow, I mean, a really short review because there's not that much in the game. So, Papa's Burgeria is the second cooking franchise in the Flip Live Studios of the Papa's Pizzeria series. So this is the sequel to Papa's Pizzeria released in 2010, Papa's Burgeria. So in Papa's Burgeria, Papa Louis, the Italian chef, decides to open up a burger joint and he asks his two fellow employees to run the restaurant. Um, I think the first guy's name is Marty, I believe, and the other character name is Rita, I think. Yeah, those are the two characters, Marty and Rita. So in Papa's Burgeria, in this game, you are actually owning a burger joint, and you have to make burgers is instead of pizzas like in Papa's Pizzeria. So the so the so the so the rules in Papa's Pizzeria are in Papa's Burgeria, but they are different now. First, you take the customer's order on the order ticket like in Papa's Pizzeria. Then you go to the grill station to grill the hamburgers. So you have to grill the meat patty. You have to make sure that the patties are cooked perfectly and after you cook the meat patty you then slide it over to the topping station where you put the ketchup the mustard the may the mayo the the barbecue sauce yes barbecue sauce is a condiment in this game who doesn't like barbecue sauce i mean barbecue sauce is, is hands down one of my favorite sauces because it's spicy has a nice bold taste to it it tastes way better than ketchup and mustard that's my opinion if you like ketchup over barbecue sauce, hey, I respect your opinion. So yeah, after you do, after you make the burgers correctly based off the order ticket, just like in Papa's Pizzeria, the customer stares at the burger to make sure if it's right, and then you'll get a good tip. But here's the downside with Papa's Burgeria: there aren't any French fries. Are you kidding me? How do you own a burger restaurant without the French fries? A little spoiler alert: the French fries were actually added into Papa's Cheeseria. Um. Yeah, Papa's Cheeseria, five years later. Are you kidding me? Five years and... So you're telling me we have to wait till five years until Papa's Cheeseria comes out until we get the French fry update? Why weren't French fries added in Papa's Burgeria? I mean, how do you eat a burger without fries? That makes no sense. So you're feeding customers burgers without no fries or no drink or anything? All they eat is the burgers. They don't get no drink or no fries. See? This is why Papa's Burgeria sucks. They ain't got no fries and they ain't got no drink for the customers to wash it down with. So you tell me they're supposed to eat the burger without nothing with the condiment side. And that's pretty much the whole thing throughout the whole game. Managing the customers, cooking the burgers, making sure that the burgers are grilled correctly, and make sure you put the correct condiments and the correct toppings on the burger for the customers to get good points. Again, they'll rank how well you do cooking the burgers until you lock new customers along the way. Like I said in my Papa's Pizzeria review, there's no ending to this game. The, end, the game is endless. It keeps going on forever and ever and ever until you lock all the customers and until you beat in the game. So that's, ladies and gentlemen, is my review for Papa's Burgeria. My verdict is 3 out of 10. Why this very low verdict? There are no french fries for the customers to eat and there's no beverages for them to wash it down with. How can Papa Louie own a burger restaurant without having fries and a drink along with the burger? I mean... That's what, what let's see right there that Papa Louie doesn't have the type of money to afford to, to afford all these restaurant chains. So yeah, that's my verdict for Papa's Burgeria, three out of ten. There's no French fries update until the so French fry update wasn't added until Papa's Cheeseria, which came out in 2015, ten years after Papa's Burgeria. So in my next review, I'll be reviewing Papa's Taco Mia. That's the next in the that's the next line of the Papa Louie cooking series. Hope you guys enjoyed the review, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye.